let's consider our plane traveling electromagnetic wave. And well, with an electric field pointing in this direction. And if we want our electromagnetic wave to travel in this direction, and we'll call that direction the I hat direction, then our associated magnetic field has to point like that. And this is just our representation of our plane electromagnetic wave. Now, suppose that wave is incident on an area in which the unit normal to the area is in the I hat direction. So it means this plane is, perp is perpendicular to the direction of propagation um, of the wave. And we've described how electromagnetic waves can transport both energy and momentum. If this is a perfectly absorbing surface, then the electromagnetic wave transfers momentum to that surface and hence exerts a pressure on that surface. And that radiation pressure, which we wrote in a time average form, was equal to the magnitude of the pointing vector times C. And we also noticed that the radiation pressure was equal to the energy density of the electromagnetic wave. Now, suppose the surface is perfectly reflecting. Well, what happens is that the force or the momentum transferred, the force on the surface due to the change in momentum of this electromagnetic wave as it comes in and bounces back is now increased by a factor of two, which means that the radiation pressure for this perfectly reflecting surface has increased by a factor of two. Now to understand that factor of two, it's simple to think about a particle of mass m moving with the velocity v, striking a fixed surface, bouncing back elastically, so it has the same velocity bouncing back, and the transfer of the change in momentum of this particle is not mv, but a factor of 2 mv because the particle is reverse direction. In the same way here, the electromagnetic wave has momentum, it's bouncing back, so the change in momentum is actually twice the same change in momentum if all of that electromagnetic wave was absorbed by the surface, and that motivates our factor two. And this describes the radiation pressure for a perfectly absorbing and a perfectly reflecting surface.